this lesson, we're doing simple subtraction without the number 5 in the tens column. So if you, if you were able to handle the ones column, of course you can handle the tens column. It is a piece of cake. It's not a bit harder. Just when we do the ones, it's right here. And if we're doing things in the tens column, we're going to be using beads in this one, this one, and that one. So a number in the ones column is only going to be the numbers 0 through 9. And if we're going to use the ten col tens column, it's going to use this column, and it's going to involve any numbers from 0 up to 99. Okay, let's do the number 44 minus 22. 44 minus 22. Well, how do you write the number 22? It's a 2 and a 2. All right, so 44 minus 22 is take away 2 here and take away 2 here. 44 minus 22 is 22. All right, let's put the number 34 on our abacus. 34. And we are going to do 34 minus 10. 34 minus 10. Now to take away 10, all I have to do is move one bead in the tens column away from the center beam. So the problem 34 minus 10 is 24. Do you see that? 24. Let's do one more. Put the number, let's do 22. 22 minus 12. So 22 minus 12 is, well, I take away one bead here and two beads there. A 1 and a 2, I took it away. So what are we left with? 22 minus 12 is 10. 1, 0, 10. I know I said one more, but let's do one more. There's always one more to do. Okay, 44. That's a fun number to do. 44 minus, or take away, 13. How do I write the number 13? It's a 1 and a 3. So let's take away 1 here. It's more fun if you make sound effects. And a 3 here. And what number am I left with? 31. 44 take away, or 44 minus 13 is 31. 31. All right, that's all we're going to do for this lesson, which is simple subtraction involving the tens column without the number five, or using only the earthly beads. Go ahead and print off your worksheet and work through the problems. Take some time getting used to doing the simple subtraction involving the tens.